Hello everyone, this is Krishna and welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to see how to integrate the toaster messages in React Native. And uh, for this, I have created a project called T Native. And in this, I am going to write the entire code in app.js. So I will be providing the link and the entire code in the GitHub repo, in the description box where you can have the entire code. And uh, before going to see the code, uh, we can see the demo of how it works. So this is the success toaster, error toaster and if info toaster. So once user clicks on this, you will be able to see a success toaster here. And this is the error toaster. And in this way we can show the information toaster. So we can uh, customize this toaster as well inside the code by using our HTML and we can uh, uh, customize the duration as well, how much time we have to show this and we can add different buttons as well like that. So we'll be seeing all this in our code. So let us see how to write that. So for this we need to install npm install react native toast. will take some time to get installed so we'll wait until it gets installed so it got successfully installed and if you want to verify you can go to package.json and here you can see the react native toast message when i am in recording this video it is 2.1.1 version and it might vary based on the time and date when you are creating this so here let's go to app.js and uh, write our code here so first we need to import the uh, dosh from uh, react native toast message this is a package which we have installed so it will be auto generated now inside this we will create a button taking touchable opacity and a text box inside this so we will write a basic toast here without any success or error it will be a basic toast which will display the toast message so inside the view let us take the toast so this should be placed at the top level of your application so this can be anywhere like app.js or root application, root uh, component. So we need to take this toast and we need to give the reference. So this will be like a method which will call toast.setref. of reference so this reference will be coming from here for setting a reference to the toast so once user clicks on this let us have a on press event here in order to show the toast we will take uh, toast dot show will take an object where we want to show the type if you don't uh, if you want to show the text directly we can have text this is the main this is the major text like the heading and this is the subtext so this will be the text one this will be the text too. So let us run this. So if you see here, the display toast got uh, reflected and once user clicks on this, the success toast will be displayed. So the success toast will be the default toast. And if you want to make it as a error toast, we can make it as a, we can make we can supply type a parameter called type 
where we can uh, specify whether it is error or info or success you can see here the info we can see the error information like this and if you want to show the information it will not be it will be a normal information you can see the color of this touch box got changed so we have different properties let us take the different properties and uh, so these are the different properties available in the toast react native toast message so the position uh, specify whether we have to show it in the bottom or the top if you are placing it at the top we can show it in the top and if you want to place it at the bottom it will get from the bottom like a slack message and uh, here the type specifies whether it is a success or an error or information as i have previously displayed the differences between them so this is the header text which we want to display and this is the uh, sub text you can see here this is sub text and uh, this is the header text so this visibility time will tell you how much time we have to display this if you specify it as 500 you can see here it is uh, going very fast and if you want to specify it as 5000 it will wait for some time and it will go automatically so the auto hide indicates that uh, if you want to uh, manually remove this toaster or if you want to automatically remove this toaster and the on show function or the method this will be called uh, once the toaster got displayed if you want to call any method or do any customized code then you can write here so once the toaster is hidden you can uh, write some customized logic here so in this way we can uh, have the different parameters in toaster message and even we have the we can design this toaster uh, in a customized manner as well like uh, applying the styles and html so we will see how to do that now so this is the customized way of uh, writing the toaster messages so for this we are not providing any type and if you want to provide the type and you have some customized uh, success toasters and cu some customized error toasters then we can specify the type here and we can uh, in the inverted commas we can specify the what type of uh, customized code we are uh, going to show and uh, here i am not specifying any type so that's the reason it will take automatically this customized logic or the customer toaster message so once user clicks on this the customer toaster message will be available here so yellow color 90 percent and uh, height so here we can have the text one and uh, subtext text two like this so in this way we can uh, customize our toaster messages in react native application so if you like this video please uh, like share and subscribe to my channel thank you